begin our journey here with this brave little piece of plastic who has more courage than perhaps we will ever know in ourselves. It has been a long travel and he has been brought by a stranger to some bizarre new land. He has much to discover. He is about to be forced from his plastic womb into the cold unfeeling world. Here he meets his new home and his new housemates who are these strange people who seem to look at him with malice what has he done to earn their disdain his attention is palpable he quivers in fear as beads of sweat drip down his face wishing to return to his safety there is no going back they set upon him a series of cruel tortures, they string him up high, he dangles far above the ground, terrified. He thinks to himself, what can await me in this new horrible place? He has no idea. They hold his head under a rush of water, he sputters and coughs trying to force the water back out of his lungs. He thinks to himself, what can drive something to commit such terrible acts on its fellow brush? They tie him at both ends, making him the twisted center of a cruel game of tug of war. They hold him down and subject him to humiliation by squeezing a white antiseptic paste all over his body. The sensation burns him not as much outside as within. His captors take his broken body and throw it into the sink pit. Our martyr begins to be stoned with a series of breastments, peppermint tic-tac, a cool irony. Altoids have never been so intense. Mentos, the fresh maker. I believe our hero sinks not. He drifts in and out of consciousness awaking into unbearable pain. He wonders if he will ever find reprieve from such torture. Will this ever end for him? It is likely not, for pain is eternal and this is just the beginning. Life is suffering.